Hey guys, people on my back. I'm Aaron. I'm Calvin. I'm Jake. And uh, we're here with an anime that's newer called the Dan Dan Dan. The Dan. Is it the Dan Dan? Dan to Dan. Dan to Dan. Dan to Dan. I think. Dan Dan Dan. How many ends are in this? Okay, Dan to Dan. I think there's only one end. One end. 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 The Dan Dan. End. Dan to Dan. It ends just once. Anyway, we're here with this. We uh, I saw a trailer for this uh, a little while back, not too long ago. Uh, but I don't really remember what all it was. But it looked odd, chaos. <laughs> I don't, I don't even think I've seen that trailer. I've just no. heard people talk about it. And yeah, it sounds just weird. Weird and fun. Yes. So we're gonna check out uh, Dan to Dan, and uh, if you guys want to check out uh, more of it along with us, make sure you check out the full length, which is available mm-hmm. here with the first episode. Uh, whether you're on Patreon or Beyond member on our website or not, you can check the link down in the description below. Check out full length. Uh, watch our entire reaction. Just make sure you have your own reference footage, and uh, let's see what the Dan Dan Dan. Did. Man, this is weird. That was an episode one, baby. <laughs> hmm. I want to look up this Ken Takakura thing, but I, I don't know if it's just for the show, so I'll wait and see what happens with that. But I don't know if it's like something I yeah. should recognize, but since he's him, I'm assuming not. Yeah, he just but, has the same name. But yeah. I want to know where it, what it's from, because why is it like he used one of Ken Takakura's lines? Like, what does that mean if he's... Yeah. I think she, she just likes the likes a specific actor or a character that that actor played and that is like her idea of like the ideal yeah guy sure but his name just like also happens to well, be Ken Tucker. he could be named after him it could, it could be an be. older actor you yeah. know that he's named after but or it's just a you know happens to be the same name it kind of feels like uh the way she's talking about Ken Tucker is the way that Toto talks about um the the girl that he likes I'm blanking on her name in JJK yes. oh yeah the the the, the like idol that he idol goes yeah that he goes and like gets his autograph from but he's like I gotta get out of this battle fast to go you know be in line for that kind of thing it's kind of the same feeling of just like that's what she thinks she wants and needs and kind of models what she does after that sure what up I'm just, like, blown away by how fucking weird that was. I didn't know... That was super weird. Super I uncomfortable. <laughs> I loved it. I liked it. I, I didn't know how horny ghosts and aliens are. Apparently very. Or maybe it's apparently just these. Apparently exclusively. Yeah. They're exclusively horny. <laughs> and we just so happened to find a, a ghost that was horny for men and aliens that were horny for women. Uh, suck my teats if I can <laughs> gobble that dog. And I was like, what? Yeah, we just were like, whoa. <laughs> what the fuck did we get into? Is, what kind of anime is this? <laughs> She's so forward for a, for a ghost. Like, you would think, like, you would be more, more, you would be more forward, like, as a human because you have limited time, but. So if, if he got all the time. If he wouldn't have ran and would have just been like, oh, um, no thanks, maybe tomorrow I'll come back. And he just like slowly walked maybe. away. Maybe you know, I don't know, like, but because she, she said because that's like a ran, that's bad. like a rule. That's like a bad thing to do in front of ghosts is to run from them. Yeah, maybe. But we, we also might just learn more about them. like the supernatural rules as we go. Yeah, because well, like she's got psychic medium powers, and then we have him who I don't know if he necessarily has powers or if it's just like he was possessed by a ghost, but then was kind of like fighting against it. So he he showed up here to try to like save her. Yeah. So like it was a mixture of his will and the ghost possessing him that got him here, kind of interrupting everything. Kind, kind of like a Venom situation. Yeah. In like the modern Venom like movies where it's like, I'm controlled by this thing, but like maybe they don't exercise it and it's <laughs> his ability. I don't know. I think it'd be cool if he got alien powers somehow. She gets like psychic medium powers because she believes in ghosts, and he gets something from aliens like alien tech. But he might just stick with. A curse. I do like. Uh, I, I really enjoy the art style. It's sometimes very simplistic in a very fun way that I that I like find very pleasing. Sure. And like the way that they use, like all the stuff that was like horror elements, really worked for me in this. Like the when he's running down the hallway and she's chasing after him, that was scary. Like that's awful. Yeah. It's and, a, it's a very like bad dream kind of feeling of like running towards. 
the end of a tunnel and it just getting further and further away. And this, and this horny old woman chasing you down that tunnel as she runs up on the ceiling. Yeah. And their their dicks kept getting scarier. Yeah, dude. Like they had a thing that was like it was like, oh Jesus. And then like they talk a little bit more and there's like and like, oh, Jesus. And I was like, ah, oh, Jesus. And I was like, ah, Jesus. Like, yeah. I just kept doing something more. I'm like, it, it was, a, it was the, uh, what were the, the, the dolls you called them? At the nesting earlier. dolls. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're, just in their dick. Their dicks are nesting dolls. Just nesting kept, dicks. Just kept expanding. <laughs> domain expansion, I don't know. At first I was terrible. like, oh, so there are species like the anti-spiral from Gurren Lagann. You know, they've evolved beyond the need beyond for, the, uh, the need for evolution and they don't have emotion and they all look the same. Yeah. But then they're like, but we want that back, and we need your ben- banana. Yeah, that was a weird thing. I, didn't I don't know that. if I, I wonder if that was just their like way of talking about reproductive organs because they talked about his as well. Or maybe it's like a translation thing too. Yeah. See, I'd understand if it was if they said we want your banana to him. I understand that more. I didn't know what they were referring to for her. Maybe yeah, maybe it's just like a slang term for like sexual organs or something. Yeah. Because they definitely said it to her. Yeah, but they said I think did they say uterus too? No, they or, did. They, they, they said they some, said they would. They said about re- reproductive organs. Or yeah, yeah. And your banana. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Right? Which they're just really obsessed Which, with. Bananas. I was like, wait, whatever it was that they said, I was like, why did you say this and, and then this? also said this yeah. when I thought what you were referring to was this before? I don't know. We might get more of that. I don't know. It might just be a weird translation thing. It might just be for comedy. It might just be they're aliens and they don't fucking know. Maybe. Yeah. This, this puts minions in a completely different light for me. <laughs> Banana. Banana. <laughs> uh, Banana. Yeah, for a second there, I thought we were going to get uncomfortable in this I, anime. For a second there, I thought you guys were going to get uncomfortable. <laughs> Guy would always look at me he's like, Aaron, you'd enjoy this, didn't you? And I was like, uh, it was okay. I'd, met, no, I'd you, probably be mostly uncomfortable just bringing it, being like, there, guys, we should do this. <laughs> and then it being like, this. Dude, be like, right, guys, I like, fucked what up. What did you bring to us, Jake? What is this? I was wrong. You um, thought this was going to be good. <laughs> for some reason, too, like, the stuff with her, I felt more uncomfortable than the, the jokes from the grandma. Yeah. But I don't know why it is. Like, I just, for uh, she me, was that's how the, it hits differently, where she's like, give me that dong. And I, for some reason, that seems funnier to me than what yeah, they were doing no, to her, where she's, like, tied up and stuff. It's definitely you know? a funnier situation. But yeah. both aren't, like, both are, are bad. bad. Yeah, both, we're talking about. But at about least he had an opportunity to fight back. She was, like, strapped to tied up and, and stuff with, like, like three naked. dudes around her and stuff. Yeah, yeah and, like, what it naked. Is. She was in a more vulnerable position. And it's just, like, way more common for sexual assault on women. Yeah. You know, so there's that implicit, like, feeling of it being gross and worse. Yeah. And I don't know. There's just something more. You just, give him back his pecker. <laughs> it's also it also helped that the granny thing happened first. Yeah. So we were taken like so out of like what? out of surprise that it kind of just the the uncomfortableness turned into like humor. It was like what? We're so taken aback. <laughs> it was, was more funny. of a of a what the fuck did she just say? <laughs> yeah. Not the oh what the fuck is gonna happen? <laughs> yeah. I'll just suck these teeth. I also I, I also dumb. feel like. In media, what? it would be... It's like the ghost of Danny DeVito. <laughs> <laughs> I also feel like in media, it would be way more likely to depict something bad happening to her than him. Mm, so I think yeah. that also just like meta knowledge makes it a little more uncomfortable. Of just like, we might see it get bad here. Mm-hmm. In like, maybe not directly, but in, in indirect ways that we're like, oh, that just happened. Versus, I don't think that was probably... I never felt that was the case with him. Mm. That might just be bias, though. Mm. I don't know. Sure. Maybe. I don't All know, right. but I liked but, it. I had fun with that. That was interesting. Whenever I saw, that's how love starts, you know. That is not what I thought <laughs> we were going to have happen. <laughs> no. But no, now we know how love starts. Guys, thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed the reaction to Dan to Dan. Uh... Whatever this was, and whatever's gonna happen next. If you uh, want to join us, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you get notifications for uh, the next episode when we have it up here on the channel. And if you wanted to check out the full length, as I mentioned before, the description and or blindwave.com, you can just go there right now for this episode, but also it is available for like everything we do. Just consider supporting over at blindwave.com.